Hey guys, so just wanted to say hello, another uh, update from me, Tea Time with Paul. Um, so yeah, a few things on my heart at the moment. Um, uh, you may be keeping in touch with my blog, um, kind of a mission we make at a blog spot. Um, so every day now I'm doing daily devotions. Uh, so that's just one of the uh, different resources I want to talk to you about uh, this time, this month. Um, okay, so uh, starting off with some key things. Uh, the first one, which I think will encourage you, is that um, the Pays uh, Global Summit is going live, kind of. Uh, in other words, we're going to record on audio the talky presentation that's done in the morning, probably about 45 minutes worth, and we will pull that on the website that day. So if you're a national director and you've got your national director's team, your team can listen to what you're hearing that day which means by the time you get back, you'd have to remember everything, try and explain everything, because they will have heard the main key message of the day. So what I would encourage you to do is begin to organise with your team that when you're at the summit, you know, that afternoon, as it were, or the next day, uh, they spend an hour where they just listen to wherever you've been taught. So when you come back, they've already got thoughts, ideas, and you can dis discuss it. Uh, second thing is that we are uh, refilming Kingdom Principles at Page USA Foundational Training and we'll be producing them as a polished um, CD and also Kingdom Patterns as well. So one of the things we're looking at doing is creating two types of categories of resources. There's going to be, if you like, the free and raw and then there'll be like the, the more polished but that will cost something. So if you imagine the difference between my blog spot and the book so my uh, blog is free to everybody, it's very raw, it's very kind of like, it's not polished, it's just random thoughts, uh, whereas the book you pay for, but it's a really good presentation of Pay's ministry, complete and well done. So we're going to start splitting the categories down into those two areas, so you're going to see more and more free resources, but you're also going to see more and more resources that people can buy if they want to. Um, a third thing that's very exciting and could really significantly affect the way uh, the teams operate in the schools is that we have um, we've set a deadline for the summit but it may be around foundational training where the teams will now be able to upload their own material onto MyPays which of course means that teams will therefore be able to go up and borrow other people's material so uh, especially if your teams have issues with spending a lot of time coming up with new ideas, there will be other pays ideas that they're going to be able to get from um, my pays, which would be great. Uh, this Saturday I'm interviewing somebody for the creative writer's position. Uh, they will help me where Sabrina left off with the book, uh, but also will help me by compiling the best ideas and policing, if you like, the material that goes online. Over a period of time, as that person gets more and more used to what we're looking for, hopefully those resources will get better. Uh, I don't know if the person on Saturday is the one I'm going to accept, but just so you know, I'm splitting again the role that Sabrina did. There'll be the creative writing and, uh, and kind of like resources. And then there'll be the kind of PA person who will manage me because uh, you know I need a lot of managing. Um, last thing, just to let you know, uh, is that uh, Jeremy, uh, I announced to you that Jeremy was going to be the uh, kind of resource director. Well, uh, last minute, and this was the bad news I had over the summer, they, they basically changed their mind about that. Um, Still not met with them yet, because um, so I can't give you any more information about that yet. Because uh, when I came back off holiday, they went on theirs. Um, but Mike Sherrill, who is the the gentleman and his wife who supported me uh, all last year financially, he's stepping into the breach. So we won't be able to do it full time yet, but um, uh, part time he's going to be managing the page resources, which means that your financial people will get. Um, him contacting them soon and kind of working with them a little bit. So there's another resource, somebody who will be a little bit more on hand than Ron was able to be to give advice and to connect, talk to you about tithes and, and other things as well. So there's a lot happening. I'm really excited about the summit. That's going to be great. I'm really, um, it's going to be very, very practical and it's going to be quite inspiring. I think it'll be different from the other ones in a different way. Um, rather than more academic, it's going to be more kind of inspirational. I'm trying to think if there's any other resources. We're just really working on trying to get more and more resources out to you guys. So hopefully you'll really enjoy them and you'll really benefit from them. But uh, yeah, feel free to email me. I'd really encourage you to get your teams, you know, and the new recruits looking at the blog spot, daily devotions. That's where the new ideas are coming from a lot of the time about teaching. And also just Twitter and things like that. Um, I obviously am expecting everybody who's coming on foundational training will have read the book. And if they're not, 
then I think that's a fairly serious issue we have to talk about um, at the summit. So hopefully make sure your guys have done that. Okay, I'll speak to you soon. Bye.